The thrilling days of all Mass Effect 2 downloadable content being free are over. After a nice string of Cerberus Network downloads offered at no cost, Kasumi's stolen memory has arrived on the scene, and it carries a price tag. This download adds just over an hour of gameplay, introduces a new party member, Kasumi Goto at your service, and offers a few other various little goodies for the price of 560 Microsoft points or seven bucks. So, is it worth it? Kasumi's story begins like any other loyalty quest in Mass Effect 2. After buying the add-on, you'll receive a notice that a new mission is available. Head to the Citadel to meet up with Kasumi, and she'll take you to a new star system a short ride away. The entire quest is not very long, but the story is touching, and the area it takes place in is gorgeous. It feels like just as much love and care was put into this mission as there was for the main game. The only real disappointments are the length and the post-mission layout. Kasumi can join your squad in future battles to help out, but you can't interact with her in the same way that you can other crew members. Along the way, Kasumi's stolen memory offers a little bit of everything. There's some straight-up combat against soldiers and mechs of all sizes. The most fun, however, happens in the lead-up to those battles. Kasumi is a master thief, and so she takes you on an infiltration mission where the two of you will sneak and talk your way through an extravagant party. It's a bit like playing James Bond, sneaking into back bedrooms and talking your way into places where you definitely should not be. Very nice. Kasumi's stolen memory is fun, and it doesn't suffer from the lack of polish that many other downloadable add-ons do, but it is quite short. I enjoyed the brief amount of time it added to my Mass Effect 2 experience, but it doesn't feel big enough to make it a good value proposition. To stay up to date on the ongoing saga of Commander Shepard, stay tuned to IGN.com.